This is the training module covering EPR forms as part of the treatment documentation section of the Introduction for Clinical Faculty and Residents. Items covered in this training include finding and completing EPR forms and entering the medical history form. EPR forms are centrally located fillable electronic documents that are used to capture specific information in a standardized way. EPR forms and Axiom function a lot like any online form. Once accessed, providers simply answer the questions presented. EPR forms are an important part of the treatment documentation process. For example, the medical history form is a frequently accessed EPR form that you will access regularly. Once you have selected your patient, you can add, review, and edit forms by access accessing them through the EHR module. Under the Forms tab, select the Add Record option to open the list of EPR forms available for use. Select New Classic Form. Select a form from the drop-down list and click OK. Let's use the Medical History form to illustrate the functionality of the EPR form. Select New Classic Form. And within the Add Form window, select the drop-down menu, then select Medical History. With the Medical History form selected, select OK. Notice that the Medical History form includes multiple tabs. The separate tabs are used to organize the kinds of data being collected. Once the form is open, start with the first tab. Answer questions by clicking once within the space to the right of each question. There are multiple answer types that can be associated with a question, including the text box, the drop-down answer menu, and the yes-no format. All of these should be pretty familiar to you. Once you have completed the form, click on the next tab or click on the red highlighted signature required box at the bottom of the window. Select yes or no to getting your patient, patient's signature on the medical history form. Remember that the medical fit history form requires a patient's signature to confirm all information has been collected accurately. Patients are required to provide an electronic signature each time their medical history is updated. Make sure all tabs within the form are addressed during your examination. With each patient visit, the medical history will be updated. You will be able to review the most current medical history at each patient visit by clicking Medical History within the Forms on File box on the right-hand side of the window. This is the area where all completed EPR forms can be accessed as needed by a provider. EPR forms offer an easily accessible way to collect detailed information to add to a patient's record. Sometimes, however, you may need to add or upload a form from your computer as an attachment. Let's move on to the next module to learn more about attaching external documents to your patient's record. Do you have more questions about EPR forms? You can contact the DCG EHR Training Coordinator to learn more about Axiom.